Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am heading to work and I'll be filming my experience there. If you don't know, I work at Warner Bros, the branch in my city at least, and we are working on some software development for an application. The time is currently 7.42 in the morning on a Friday, but there's a lot of snow and my hands. Look at my hands, you guys. This is all the proof you need. My hands are fully red and i know someone's gonna be like why don't you have gloves well listen how am i supposed to record with gloves on my phone's just gonna slip and fall in the snow and i'm just like you know i'll take one for the team let my hands freeze and protect the phone does that make sense <laughs> excuses excuses sorry i'll see you guys at work for real now I have arrived to my destination. Well, kind of. I'm currently walking towards the building, if you couldn't tell. And there it is from the outside. Here's a look at the Warner Bros. Discovery sign right there. Looking nice. And yeah, let's head on into the building itself. Ta-da! We have the foyer with, you know, more things there. That's the main lobby. We've got some flowers, obviously. I love the floral decor. This is just the beginning, you guys. Everything gets way crazier as we continue to walk this way. We've got the door. <laughs> We've got an elevator. We've got three doors here. On this side, we just have the way back to the office, which doesn't feature any decor yet, but I will be showing you guys all the decor momentarily. We are going to start off with this side. You guys, look at this. What does that say? Herbology. <sighs> There's an actual herbology thing in there. I know, like, they always tend to um, match the vibe with the room. Very nice. I just love the decor, not gonna lie. It is amazing. We've got the room of requirements. First off, on this side, we've got a popcorn machine that pops corn. Who would have thought? Amazing. Such an amazing thing. Got a TV there. Got these lights. These gorgeous lights. I love this. Then we've got unlimited candy. Like look, rockets, popcorn bags, Twizzlers, Skittles, blankets. Oh, these are the ponchos. These are the ponchos. I think I'm gonna grab one actually to my desk. <laughs> Don't mind if I do. This is my favorite room. And I only just found out that it's locked from there but you can enter through there. I wanted to show you one more room. Diagon Alley. Diagon Alley. Now, unfortunately, the utter crime of book murder has occurred in this very room. It's literally screwed on the wall, like all of them. Um, you can, you can't even, wait, can you? I'm gonna try this. You can literally read the book. <gasps> no way, it got screwed with a screwdriver. <gasps> okay, this is murder. This is book murder. We've got the bathroom here, and we've got my favorite spot in the entire building, you guys. Okay, that's another bathroom. Another bathroom. The gym. We have a gym here. We have a little gym here. I am telling you, I live here. Okay, I actually live here. So we have this little um, row machine, which is super useful. Now this room is actually rather tiny. It's pretty small, but it's sufficient because I don't need a large room to work out. Anyway, exercise room. This place is amazing. I love it so much. Let's just get out of here before I start a workout right now. I love the treadmill. We are going to make our way this way. Near Herbology, we've got the Great Hall. I can hear myself. The echo is incredible. We've got all these chairs. You can just sit down and have fun. And we've got this little uh, art piece on the wall. But you guys, we're gonna see the very first Easter egg, which is the Fox the Phoenix Lego set right there. Now Fox is staring into a gray wall. <laughs> we also have a chess board right here, the Harry Potter chess set. These are the various coffee machines. Now I don't drink coffee, although I do love to enjoy myself a nice cup of hot milk chocolate on a warm day. And of course up there we have the Great Hall written out in chalk. Which so we have like these cookies today cookies and biscuits we've got we've got these chips we've got doritos we've got a large pool of different snacks and my favorite fig bars we've got the blueberry ones we've got the raspberry ones welch's gummies and kirkland peanuts and yes 
That is the Great Hall. And if you look on top there, we have these little lights. I've never tried the cereal here. I typically eat at home then I come. Okay, apart from more snow. Look at that. We have a Hogwarts Quidditch game. Now, basically, I'll grab the Slytherin one. Quidditch, Hogwarts. You basically take this and you throw it into one of these. You guys ready for this? And I'm gonna do it with a microphone in my hand, my other hand, and a phone literally next to my elbow. But you know what, let's do this. Oh! <laughs> okay, I'm trying one more time. Yay! <gasps> Guys, <laughs> I still managed to lose. <laughs> Cheating. <laughs> no, okay. Okay, this has to work now. Ha! I win. Anyway, yes. Let's get out to the next room. <gasps> Guys, this is where I live. I live here. Now this is where the video gets very exciting. Why? Because we have ourselves a Harry Potter themed nook. But uh, you basically go here. And you just lounge. You just lounge. And you stare at the ceiling. You know what? <laughs> All you're missing is a blanket at this point. You've got an owl right there just staring at you. It's amazing. We also have a wand wall there. If you look super closely, we've got a wand for Bellatrix Lestrange. But these wands look incredible. Like, look at that. And in this corner, we have a bean bag. Oh, I love bean bags. I would just sit here on this bean bag and just stare at those boxes. And on this side, I guess this is like another little thing there, right across the Harry Potter nook, we've got this, uh, I guess it's like a whiteboard, and we've got an owl with the letter. And this here is actually the headmaster's office, which is nice, and that is Ravenclaw. And right across from Ravenclaw, we've got Hufflepuff. You essentially have a chair, a little TV, a yellow wall with some Hufflepuff themed decor. I believe that's like an Etsy art piece. I love how they support small businesses. It's amazing. And on the wall there, there's a platform nine and three quarters a plaque, which is so cool to see. And there's like a wooden finish there. Sometimes they have like little ads or, you know, little clips of movies playing on that TV there, which is so cool. And I forgot to show you guys the sorting hat. Now I actually put on this hat the other day and it screamed Slytherin, so <laughs> that's all the proof I needed right there. You can actually wear it on, and it's very fun to play with, and we have a little train. And a London to Hogwarts ticket there. This is very nice. And on this side, we actually have a Lego set. I actually have this one, so this is awesome. It's the Hedwig one, and a little Warner Bros. Discovery plaque right there. And right here, we just have a staircase which leads all the way up. Which is where we'll be going next so yeah we have the Gryffindor and Slytherin rooms they're basically the exact same as the Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw rooms however they have slightly more room for bigger meetings because I guess there are more people sorted into the Slytherin and Gryffindor houses as soon as you walk up these stairs you've got all these Game of Thrones references now I have never seen Game of Thrones so I have no idea we've got the Tower of Joy now if you've seen it there you go, just enjoy it. <laughs> we have Sun Sphere right there. We've got the dragon. The dragon eating a person. A maiden in distress. A criminal. And some more rooms. And I guess look a little secret kitchen there. If you walk this way, we have Salt Shore. We've got the Game of Thrones decor right about there. We've got these wooden panel boards right here. Now the quote wall actually hides a bunch of quotes. Now it says, great job, keep it up, proud of you, love you, everything is figure outable, nice, life is short, eat dessert first. Speaking of dessert, I think I'm gonna show you guys a donut shop that's right next to my work that my friend told me about. Shout out to her because it's so yummy. Positivity wall, I just love this place. I just sometimes sit here, reminisce and write code on this side. We have where most people sit and just play games like Monopoly or some of these little uh, games, I guess. And the High Garden. Now, in this little garden, 
can sit down, you can eat lunch, you can cuddle up with this fuzzy fluffy blanket. Now if you know me at all, you know I love my fluffy blankets. And you can stare at snow. I believe we can go to the third floor, <clears throat> which should be rather exciting. This is actually a very large action figure. We've got Wayne Manor. Pretty small for a manor, if I do say so myself, but it works, and I love the high chairs there. This is my first time actually like paying attention to this section. We've got, oh my god, look here. We've got these um bricks and candy and stuff. Um, and just casually, right there. Got a baby's head. Very casual. Love that. Anyway, on this side, as we sneak around the building. Ooh, birds of prey. <clears throat> We've got some more chairs here, tables. And, hold on, the Batmobile. The gigantic Lego Batmobile. This one is so cool, just chilling there. And it makes sense that it's here on the Batman floor of all floors. Got the minifigures, got the Batmobile. We've got some things here that I've never seen before. Lounge area with more bean bags. There should be a bean bag counter. You can even play mini golf right there. I would try my hand at it, but I am no golfer, so yes. We're just gonna tap our card here and we're gonna go back to our desk. But here is my desk, everybody. So I just have monitors, my laptop, my little notebook where I write notes as I figure things out, my jacket, and we've got a bunch of computers. Yay! So I'm gonna go and do some code now. So we are essentially in charge of the HBO Max application. So if you click on that right there, you can see that, you know, we have The Last of Us. Everybody subscribe to my channel right now. If you aren't subscribed, just do it. Just do it right now. It is currently 12.06 p.m., which means I can go on my lunch break. Um, I guess a little tour here. <laughs> the snow is crazy. Um, but you know what? We're venturing out to get those donuts. Oh, let's go get those donuts. I'm about to brave the cold once again. And I just don't want to keep rambling. So I'll see you guys once I make it to the donut shop. It should be around a 10 minute walk. See you guys then. So there's the store, you guys. They have apple fritters. Yes. We've acquired the goods, you guys. We've done it. Alrighty, so <clears throat> I just devoured my fritter which was delicious shout out to my friend for recommending it it was so good it is currently 12 48 p.m and i'm going to have to go and get ready so i can do some work i think i have a meeting at 1 30 that i need to attend i'm just casually sitting by privet drive you know very casual but yes guys i'll see y'all shortly it is currently 1.47 p.m. and it seems like all of my tests are actually passing, which is fantastic. Um, I can't really show the rest of the code, but uh, yeah. And if you look out the window, let me just slide over. It stopped snowing, which means I'll be very comfortable. So I'm about to pack all my stuff because I'm done work for the day. I would say that today was a pretty successful day. I managed to record. I did everything that I'm supposed to do and I worked out, I did everything. You know what, that's pretty awesome. I even got myself an apple fritter, so that was pretty cool as well. And yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Let me know in the comments down below what you guys thought of this tour and, and if you plan on working at Warner Brothers because I would totally recommend that. It's such a fun company. There's so many cool things to do here. And yeah, and on that, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye for now.